Okay, so got totally skunked for sailfish again. The, this is why bad weather, raining everywhere. And so we came over here to Phantom Divers to do a bull shark dive and we killed it. It was raining, it was pissing down rain really bad, but uh, overall it was a hell of a good dive, man. There was a lot of sharks, the sharks were really on fire and it was cool, man. <laughs> so this is day three of uh, this adventure. It was an intense day of diving. I mean, you want to talk about um, just being emotionally spent from just uh, just having tigers everywhere. I mean, it started out, the morning started out, we had three tigers. Then on the second dive, we had four tigers. And then on the third dive, we had another four tigers. By the end of our, by the last dive of the day, we had over eight tigers hanging around. It was just insane. We had just, I mean, it was just, um, yeah, man. I mean, it was just a hell of an awesome day diving. Just got back from a dive. We were out there with uh, Randy Jordan of Emerald Charters, and we went out to go check out the lemon shark aggregation, which happens off of a Jupiter, Florida, you know, at the beginning of the year. Uh, this was amazing. I haven't been out here since 2003 and Randy took me out back in 2003 to show me the aggregation when it was first happening. So it was really cool to get back out here and see the sharks and see what's going on out here. A shitload of sharks. I mean this place is going off right now. It's a great time of year to come out and visit this area. And uh, we, were, we also got to hang out with a Goliath grouper which I'd never seen one so it was just a really cool treat for me to check out. And we also had a baby tiger come in, which looked really shit. It looked like a, a reef shark wearing a tiger shark jacket. It's just really small, super cute. Oh shit, yeah. So here we go, man. One last hurrah. This is the last day. Yesterday we lost the day due to a bunch of storms being out there and just completely mucked it up. So we weren't able to go diving. Uh, today we got one more shot at Great Hammerheads. Uh, our first day out here, we had three great hammerheads and six bull sharks, and it was just an amazing day. I mean, it was non-stop. Once we got down there, the great hammerheads were there, and it was non-stop all day long. And it was just, it was an amazing day in the water. Um, the visibility wasn't the greatest, but shit, man, we had three great hammerheads and a bunch of bull sharks. How do you fucking lose? So we just did a one tank dive here at the, the cove. Can I see the cove way in the back? <laughs> yeah, I do have to say it was cold as shit, but we did get two seven gills and one taupe shark and check out all the gear. Yeah. Little boat, a lot of divers. Little boat and a lot of divers. Five days of diving with the great hammerheads. We we're only able to get out four days uh, on our la on Thursday. Uh, the weather started crapping out so we had to cut it short and then friday it was just no going out just i mean the conditions just went to shit. we had hammerheads every day that we were out here uh on tuesday we had just one of the most epic days i've ever experienced with these animals it was just an amazing amazing day we had four great hammerheads non-stop for three hours straight it was just um and when i mean non-stop they were just right they stayed right in front of us for the entire time it was just, it was really special. Uh, day three of the uh, Shark Week shoot here off of New Zealand. And uh, pretty stoked, man. We've had a couple of days with uh, some pretty good white shark action. Um, it's not, it, we haven't, we still haven't nailed uh, the, the story yet and we still haven't got the shots that we're after, but uh, so far it's been pretty amazing. Um, right now we had, I think on day one, it was beautiful conditions, it was really sunny. We had a lot, you know, a few sharks hanging around, and then yesterday it just kind of got gloomy and, and rainy, and today the same thing. It's kind of cool, and we got uh, some foul weather, but uh, it's pretty cool, man. This Today we're on the other side of the island, so it's pretty fucking awesome out here, man. I'm just excited to be here, you know? I mean, it's surreal and, and uh, exciting to know, like, hey, <laughs> this is my job, this is my life.
reality ever is is the fact that you know how everything's kind of changing a few years ago i mean it was what year 2000 people thought it was impossible to dive outside the cage with tiger sharks now here we are um in 2014 diving with crocodiles like this you know people thought it was impossible that they would just eat you the second you got in the water but you know people were safely doing it you know it's all about rules but it is possible and that's what's really cool about this experience is you know, showing what's possible with these animals it's day two of our second week out here with the whale sharks um, there's easily over a hundred sharks you can see the boats kind of scattered this way there's way over a hundred sharks hanging out here and the thing is that the the group of whale sharks have broken up into two groups so we have way out there you can see a bunch of boats hanging out over there where they got another big pocket of sharks so there's got to be at least three four hundred animals out here uh, it's a hell of an amazing day the water is almost purple it's blue I mean the visibility is amazing and uh, this is why you keep coming out here man because every day is different you're always gonna see something different when you're out here you know with the conditions the water the animals it's just awesome, man. Can't wait to see what tomorrow brings.